Well, good evening to you and welcome on this most perfect Hello, evening everybody. for a game of football to, to which match. we look forward immensely. It's hardly a surprise that everybody has come here in their droves, this being a fixture that has received so much coverage in the days leading up to it. And it's good to see that we have a good contingent of visiting fans by the look of it too. The atmosphere is amicable, the conditions do bring out the best in everyone and I think we're all looking forward to a feel-good game. And the match day noise at this place is truly special. The pride, the passion, it adds to a massive sense of occasion. Well, as you can see, we've already started here. Oh, good read. Challenge just a bit on the firm side. Uh, that looks a foul. Yep, referee's given it. Latch on to this. Uzbekistan have themselves a corner, I think. Yes, they do. Cleared away. And now a sudden chance to counter. That is wildly off target. Well, he did get himself into a good position. Something for him to cling to. Japan are seeing more of the ball, but still aren't carrying much goal threat. Played out to the right. Away from immediate danger. Oh, there's the clearance. Oh, what a mistake! And he's just the keeper to beat! But there's the hit! Goal! Japan! First blood drawn! The breakaway clinical and clean, and the finish unerring. Well, talking about being hit on the break, the ball was in their net before they could even organise their defence. It was fast and furious, After and all but unstoppable. Number nine. So we have our breakthrough. Well, this will present the manager with a, a few interesting options, Peter. Try sitting on this or, or push on with the opposition now forced to come out. Endo. And if you have just joined us, still just one goal between them. And the score is 1-0. Works it forward. Kubo. It looks very much like they'd be happy to settle for this narrow lead at the break. And that interception was most necessary. Out towards the flank. Mitoma! He's done very well to get to that. Really looked sharp there, didn't he? That's very well played.
He's tried one! Well, he should have done better, and he knows it. Yeah, that's a decent try when you consider the range. Two added minutes has been indicated. He'll try from distance. And we've reached half-time. Steady, solid, and for now, where they want to be. Just one goal, and they have it. Good effort from both sides, but at half-time, it is 1-0. Any opinion you'd like to express on the first half? At least, Peter, not conceding another goal has kept them in this game, and they can up their response in this second half. Japan leading a cagey game here. It's had its moments, and it's 1-0 at the break. So off we go once more. Well, 1-0 may be good enough, so they may err on the side of caution and, and get... He's going for goal! A collective sigh of relief from the defence. You lucky boy, you lucky, lucky boy. Give... He's having a goal! Uzbekistan really were asking for trouble there by failing to cope with a, a formidable press. So that's two now without reply. The turning of the screw comes to mind, Peter. They've got them where they want them. Now it's Minamino. Clears it out of harm's way. Well, they've stamped some authority on things, but how much more authority can be generated? The attendance for this match managed to get it away. Distributed tidily. And the defence can get it clear. And out to safety. Oh, easy pickings there. Toma. with bite they won it back and a bit hard to make a change for the first time in the game here. Well, I think his job here, Peter, is going to be to reinvigorate that attack, just change the rhythm up front. A case now of complete control. Substitution. They need to play this quicker in transitions like this. Kubo. Minamino. Shot goal! Well, that is remarkable. It was very much worth a try, and I've seen worse. That should tee him up nicely for his next attempt at least. Substitutions taking place. Uzbekistan making consecutive changes here. 
Well, for me, this was the obvious substitution. He'd become just a little jaded, and as a result of that, he was most likely to make a mistake. I think sometimes when the body becomes tired, the brain goes with it, and I think that's happened in this case. Oh, here's a chance! A real chance and a real let-off. Minamino put absolutely everything he had into that. Maybe better look next time. Japan are coasting towards victory. He's away! Decent hit! It's a goal! It is no contest! It is a landslide! Well, there's always a chance of being caught like that when you surrender the football. And there was his third, and boy, he looks the business. Doesn't he just? Oh, this has been an immense contribution from one player. He's been just about unplayable. The irresistible force today. Japan, totally rampant here. Toba. Six added minutes has been indicated. It's a good foot in there. Tries to get it clear. Minamino. He's got space in the area. <laughs> Referee looks at his watch and blows his whistle. Japan pretty much in utopia, imposing themselves in the manner they wanted right from the start. A show all about one side's remorselessness, ruthlessness, relentlessness. So, Jim, how do you reflect on what we've seen? Japan simply imposed their strength from start to finish, and this became as predictable as predicted. Thank you very much for your cooperation. And all that remains for me is to thank Jim Beglin. That's it from us tonight. A very good evening to one and all.